Hi guys, I'm Alex and I'm from the Miami Valley School and this semester I'm taking a TEDx class um, and we were told recently to take an online strengths finder quiz um, and this video is about my results of my top five strengths. Now, number one is ambition. I'm certainly ambitious um, but usually though I think of ambition and over competitiveness as a, as a weakness more so than a strength because <clears throat> like usually Usually, like, say, my friends and I are really competitive, um, and say one of us does really well on a quiz or test. Now, the usual response would be, oh, good job, or well done, but part of me is always like, oh, crap, they did better than I did, or how am I going to catch up with them if they're always doing better than I am on tests or something. So, yeah, I've always hated that part, um, but it keeps on popping up, so. It's, it's good, though, to see... A strengths finder test um, show ambition as a strength because I can see how it can um, be the root of innovation and advancement in the future so that's good okay the next one is focus but I don't really see why focus is one of my strengths because I get distracted easily like I'm reading an a push chapter and I read like three sections or something and I'm like oh, I'm just gonna watch two or three episodes of arrow you have failed this city! But when I do put my mind to a task, though, I usually do finish it without interruption. Um, I have like an all or nothing philosophy where I'm like either going all into a subject or a task at hand or I'm not going to do it at all. So like say I have 15 minutes to study or something or do homework. Like I'm not going to use it to do homework at all because 15 minutes, like that's not enough time for me to get fully immersed into focus um, in the task. But if I have like 10 hours or so set purely for homework, I'll, I'll use that and get immersed and finish the task. Um, oh, this says change is tough for you. Ensure you talk and plan for change in terms of new goals to champion. Well, I certainly don't like change. Yeah. Okay, next up is strategic thinking. It says, always give yourself plenty of time to think through a situation. I know. Like, on tests, I have, like, a tendency to over-check or overthink a problem. Like, I will not be comfortable submitting an answer unless I've checked it two or three times um, and checked my logic and stuff. I mean, it's... it's so far, it works perfectly on like school tests where I have plenty of time, but things get tricky when I have to take AP exams or the SAT where time is an issue and I have to change my strategy so to from like high accuracy but long time taking to um, medium-ish accuracy but taking a short amount of time. Um, yeah, I, I don't like doing that, but sometimes I have to. Seek situations that worked in other places, learn from them, and try to apply them to your life and work. That's what I do. Self-motivation. Um, along with competing with my friends, I have this fierce competition with myself too. Um, so I guess this could count as self-motivation. Um, you are most effective when... Yeah, wait, uh, you are most effective when you are in control of your world. Yeah, that applies to almost everyone. But, yeah, self-motivation, usually... Usually I'm only motivated if I feel like it's worth being motivated, you know? But if I am self-motivated, I usually see a task to its end. Um, but I usually don't find myself in many situations where I am needing self-motivation to finish it. Um, but it's always good to see that self-motivation is a strength of mine. Finally, my last strength is faith. Um, it says here, make efforts to discover your true passion and tie it to your work, no matter what you do. Well, yeah, as a child, though, I, I really love making stuff out of paper, you know, paper airplanes, paper, paper handguns, you know, paper, maybe mainly paper airplanes. Um, but yeah, but my parents are always like, Eric, you must become doctor, you know, um, so... Now, now it's compromise, you know. I have, I, I've said to become a surgeon, you know, 
doctor, hands-on stuff, surgeon. That uh, was good. Thank you for watching my top five strengths video over my strengths finder test results. Uh, again, my top five strengths were ambition, focus, strategic thinking, motivation, and faith. Alex out.